Thank you, Mayor Pons, and hello. I'm Cliff Fleet, and I'm honored to represent the Colonial Williamsburg Foundation and my colleagues at today's virtual State of the City Address. I want to thank the Mayor and City Council for this opportunity to speak about our collective vision for the future. We're excited to be working with you to make Williamsburg an even more vibrant and welcoming place for everyone to live, work, and learn. I arrived at the Foundation in January, just before the onset of the pandemic and so much more that has made 2020 a year that none of us could have ever predicted. As you probably know, we were among the many businesses and organizations in town that closed our doors this past spring. For three months, the longest extended closure in Colonial Williamsburg's history. Challenges remain as tourism returned slowly to pre-pandemic levels, but we are truly humbled by the outpouring of support from our local leaders, our neighbors, and our generous donors to make sure that our educational mission continues even during this extraordinary time. You have shown us in so many ways what this foundation means to you and that you want us to succeed. And we will by working with our partners at the city and surrounding counties and with our colleagues at the university to make smart, coordinated decisions that best serve the greater Williamsburg region. For 95 years, Colonial Williamsburg has played a central role in our community's enduring appeal among residents and guests. As we approach our centennial in 2026, we are renewing our commitment by strengthening partnerships and forging new ones to bring us all closer together and contribute to our region's quality of life. This year, we provided over 30,000 meals and thousands of pounds of food to our neighbors in need through partnerships with area nonprofit agencies. And through our collaboration with First Baptist Church, the city, and William and Mary, we began a long overdue excavation to find and study the church's first permanent structure. Our work on this project will intensify next month, and we look forward to sharing our findings with you. We've also expanded our online presence to bring our programming and research to millions of viewers. If the pandemic has taught us anything, it is how important digital outreach is to sharing America's story with the world. We are committed to increasing and enhancing our virtual programming so that we can reach more people than ever. Mayor Pons mentioned the regional sports complex proposed for what is now the Visitor Center campus. We join our partners across the jurisdictions in support of this project which promises to diversify our local economy in critical new ways and make our region an even more enjoyable, exciting place to live and to visit. The Visitor Center campus opened in 1957 to accommodate families spending a week or more exploring Colonial Williamsburg and supporting area businesses. It was an important facility that has served millions of guests through the years. But over time, our guests' expectations have changed considerably. How they plan and take trips has changed dramatically. For example, almost half of our visitors now purchase digital tickets. Advances in technology are allowing us to reimagine the guest arrival experience in exciting new ways. The regional sports complex will transform downtown Williamsburg into a much more dynamic place. We thus fully support it and have other projects under consideration as well that align with the city's vision. As our community moves through the planning process on these and future projects, we look forward to hearing from you, our neighbors, so that we make decisions together that are in the region's best interests. We have already made significant investments in Merchant Square this year and will continue to do so. These future investments include repaved parking lots, new lighting, enhanced landscaping, and exciting new merchants. We are now planning a southward expansion of Merchant Square to include a mix of retail, living, and office spaces, as well as enhanced parking. We also plan to transform the Spotswood Golf Course into a high-quality, walkable residential neighborhood. This new project supports the city's plan to create a livelier downtown that enhances the city's natural beauty while respecting our traditions, and it will sit adjacent to the Williamsburg Inn and Golden Horseshoe Golf Club. When complete, our new neighbors will be within walking distance of Merchant Square, William & Mary, the historic area, 
the art museums, and other surrounding businesses. We believe that all of these projects will enhance Williamsburg as both a destination and a place to live, and look forward to working with the community on them. Colonial Williamsburg's continued success, we know, is tied directly to that of our community. The foundation exists for the benefit of the community, and we look forward to working with you on projects that improve the economy and the region's quality of life for the next generation and beyond. We are, all of us, stronger together. And together, we will create positive change that drives success for the region.